Welcome back to Classmates Bell B Season 9, presented by Classmate, powered by the Times of India. This is an initiative by Radio Mirchi. Before the break, I'd asked you what the name of the most common vowel sound in English is. The answer is schwa. That's right, schwa. Schwa is the term for the uh sound you hear in the words the, potato and percolate. Well, on that note, let's get back to our amazing contestants in round two. It's neck and neck at the moment. All three of our contestants have 40 points, but Aman has not played round two, so let's call him to the podium. Let's welcome Aman from St. Michael's School in Shiliguri. So Aman, four words to spell in round two, but I don't have to tell you that you only have to spell one word correctly to make it through to round three. Your first word is Euclidean. Can I have the definition? Relating to or denoting the system of geometry based on the work of Euclid. E-U-C-L-I-D-E-A-N. Absolutely correct. I'm very, very happy to tell you you're already through to round three. We'll continue round two with you just to see how well you do. Your second word for 10 points is rapacious. May I have the definition? Aggressively greedy or grasping. The origin? It is of Latin origin. Could you use it in a sentence? I can. With landlords as rapacious as mine, who'd want to ever visit a wildlife reserve? R-A-P-A-C-I-O-U-S. Absolutely right. <laughs> Tearing ahead now at 60 points. Only two words remain for you. Your third word for 10 points is rodomontade. May I have the definition? Boastful or inflated talk or behavior. Could you use it in a sentence? Someone who indulges in rodomontade when he's riding his luck is likely to be a sore loser when he's not. R-O-D-O-M-O-N-T-A-D. Absolutely right. I don't think it's luck you're riding on. I think it's all that hard work. Only one more word in round two. If you spell this word correctly, you will have a perfect score at the end of round one and two put together. That word is vice rain. I cannot take the classmate connect to three, right? You can't, so if you would like to use it, now is the time to use it. You have I would like to, to take my classmate. Classmates. It means, of course, the wife of a viceroy. It is a French origin. So I'll take it and the spelling is V-I-C-E-R-E-I-N-E. -E -E. Yes, that's okay. Do you agree with them? You're right, they're right. Very well done, Aman. You have a perfect score of 80 points. I have to tell you, Aman, nobody has scored so well in this season, nor in season eight, which you were part of last year. So you've done incredibly well. A huge round of applause for Aman. Please have a seat. At the end of round two, our leaderboard stands at currently tied in second position with 40 points apiece, Adya Shukla and Bhagyashri, and our current leader with a perfect score of 80 points, Aman Ahmed. We're at the end of round two, and we know that Aman has gone in to round three, but who will join him? Will it be Bhagyashri or Adya? We'll have to have a tie-breaking round on the buzzer. Good luck to the both of you. Let me explain the rules of the tie-breaking buzzer round to you. Before I give you the word to spell, I will give you three clues. I will give you the part of speech. I will give you the language of origin. And I will give you the definition of the word. I will then give you the word to spell. If you spell the word correctly, you will automatically go through to round three. If you misspell the word, we will play again. If you misspell the word twice, you will be eliminated from the competition. All the best, Adya and Bhagyashri. Your word to spell is derived from Middle English. It is a verb and it means to stay longer than expected. And that word is tarry. Adya? T-A-R-R-Y. That is absolutely right. Very well done, Adya. And with that, you're through to round three. Congratulations. Bhagishi, did you know how to spell Terry? Yes, I did. It was just that you were a little slower on the buzzer. I'm afraid that means that we do have to say goodbye to you now. 
Is there anything that you would like to say? Wish you all the best. Thank you. Wonderful words of sportsmanship. Will you be able to come back? Yes, I'll come back next year. I look forward to seeing you. All the very best. Let's give a big hand to Bhagyashri. Please have a seat, Bhagyashri. Log on to the website www.classmatespellb.in to play games, win prizes, and even qualify for Classmate Spell B Season 10 by participating in the Spell Challenge series. Connect with co-spellers on Facebook and Twitter and find out how you measure up against India's spelling masters. Download Classmate Spell B's free mobile app from the Google Play Store or iTunes and explore its fun games and word puzzles. We're going to be taking a short break now, but don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with Classmates Bell Beast Season 9, powered by The Times of India.